I'm Sean Gannon, and this is Minute Math, and today we're going to learn about systems of two equations. I want to solve each system by elimination. So, if I was given this system, negative 8x minus 10y equals a positive 24, and the second equation would be 6x plus 5y equals 2. Well, I can easily identify that 2 times 5 is my 10. And since that is negative 10 up top, that's all we need to do. So all I'm going to take now is my second equation and multiply it all by a positive 2. So let's re uh, rewrite the first equation, negative 8x minus 10y, and that's equal to 24. The second equation, I'm going to multiply the whole thing by 2. 2 times 6x is a 12x, and 2 times 5y is a 10y. And 2 times 2 is a 4. <clears throat> From there, I'm going to add these two equations together, top to bottom. Negative 8x plus a 12x is a positive 4x. And negative 10y plus a positive 10y should eliminate, that was the whole point, is 0. 24 plus 4 is a 28. So now we want to eliminate, or not eliminate, <laughs> or we can eliminate the 0, we don't really need that. I'm going to get x by itself. So I have to divide by 4 both sides. That leaves me with x by itself. And uh, 4 goes into 28 uh, 7 times. So x is just 7. From there, I need to plug that back into one of my equations. Now, I find the, um, oh wow, now the second equation easier. So I'm going to rewrite that second equation here 6x plus 5y equals 2. And I'll plug that 7 in for x. Okay? So 7 goes in for x right there. And what I want to do is 6 times 7 right here. Substitute that in. 5y equals 2. And I'm going to solve for y. 6 times 7, 42. Plus 5y equals 10. Now I'm going to subtract a 42 to both sides. Leaving with 5y equals, well, that's a negative 42 minus 42. Divided by 5. And I have y that's written here by itself. Negative 40 divided by 5 is a um, negative 8. And there we have it. We have our y value, we have our x value. Together, they can make a coordinate point, which is 7, comma, negative 8. And there we go. Our final answer. So let's recap. We're given negative 8x minus 10y equals 24, and 6x plus 5y equals a 2. Well, I multiply the second equation by 2 all the way across for all parts, and then I added the top and the bottom equation to eliminate the y variable. That left me with 4x equals 28. Divide both sides by 4 to get x equals 7. Once I had that, I plugged that into my second equation, and it can be any equation. I just chose the second equation and solve for y. After simplifying, what I ended up doing and getting was y to be a negative 8. From there, I have my two um, values, x and the y value, so I can write it as a coordinate point, and that's properly to write this. And so our final answer, again, is just 7, negative 8. 